Playoffs, rings, and trophies. That's the expectations Robin has set forth for this team. And this season, I can promise you, these guys have a chip on their shoulder. The core of this group is strong. The leaders have seen it all. Pricey, Keegan, and Ruby. Oh! Leadership starts at the top, and our head coach Robin is unwavering. Add in a treasure trove of young talent, and we have what it takes to reach the top. Again. We're built from within. Our academy and homegrowns, they're the backbone and the future. But it's the spirit of our fans and the players. That connection between our club and this beautiful state, that's the most exciting part. When this group leaves this locker room and walks past that trophy and onto that field, they know what they're playing for. Colorado's kind of this used to be hidden gem. The weather, the climate, the topography, everything here is really, really fantastic. And just not that many people know about it. And I think that in a lot of ways that relates to, to this club and the way that we go about our business. It makes for a good locker room if players are in different positions and have different sets of motivations as long as they're motivated. Así es, así es. es lo, yo siempre lo he dicho desde que juego al fútbol que lo más importante es ganar, ganar como equipo, ¿verdad? Eh, obviamente yo tengo un papel bastante importante eh, que es el de intentar hacer goles, ¿verdad? Hacer goles o crear los goles que, que me hace ese, tener un poco más de esa presión eh, para ayudar al equipo a ganar. When you uh, attribute success to a team, you look at the leaders first, you look at the voices first. Jack Price has, has been our captain since, since the beginning. You've got to look at Danny Wilson, you've got to look at Jack Price, you've got to look at Diego Rubio. Those are the key players when you look at this. When you're looking at, at leadership on a team, you're looking at the spine. And then you bring in some former players that played in Cole Bassett coming back from Europe. You know, considering myself a, a veteran and experienced player now, it's it's super energizing to have young players be such a big part of the club as well. Darren Yappy, one of the homegrowns, a young 17-year-old who could mix into that group. I think personally he'd be really happy because <laughs> it's been my goal all along, making the first team and being an impact for them. Adam Beaudry, I'm from Castle Pines, Colorado, and I'm a goalkeeper for the Rapids Academy. So again, you're trying to mix and you're trying to find this just little bit of chemistry so it kind of comes together at the right time. After the progress we've had over the last couple of years to not make the playoffs this past year was a real uh, stinger. And I would say goal number one for this year has to be to get back into the playoffs. I definitely think pushing for top of the West and then you know trying to push further in playoffs than we have uh, in, the, in the last 10 years or so and, and try to get that cup. I don't think you have any success as a professional athlete if you're not rabid about wanting to win. At the end of every season, there's one coach that's happy. And the rest of them are pissed off and can't wait for next season to start so that we can, we can actually work toward it. Colorado is a place to be challenged and to grow. It's a place you can test yourself with an incredible community at your side. Where opponents dread playing, and our fans make sure they know it. Our history runs deep with cups, trophies, and legendary names. And with our homegrown talent and academy, the best might still be yet to come. In 2023, with this squad, with these fans, the mountaintop might be closer than we think. Watch out, MLS. Colorado is coming.